communicate with a client because now if your client tells you i want something long please try to um when you're plating you plate as you trying to observe the hair that you the lines that you're doing like most in especially in front in front if someone because now that's when people keep on saying pack pack you do the packing so in front if the hair is over packed trust me it's not good Alright, yes, uh, my name is Maurice, the Crochet Master, and I would like to welcome everyone. Yes, I think this is going to be like our, our first our first session when we are setting uh, these individual uh, dreadlocks. And uh, most of you guys have not yet tried them on, and so this is my first time to do it. So I created this thing like depending on those people like who always get scared of locking and then uh, I decided to do it this way so that those ones who always uh, get scared of locking their hair you can still have this like individually from the start. So we are going to continue with our, um, our method like the way we always do but uh, uh, following like all these steps. So if it's your first time please just give me your attention so that we can do uh, this together and for everything like don't uh, forget about our our product that we already use yeah when it comes to natural hair you also know that other uh, livara products works for us yes you can always get the kit because now the kit is always uh, it it is it is good if you get the shampoo the treatment and uh, the conditioner all those ones are always good like for the natural hair so what you can always do you can uh, go in my description and try to see those uh, uh those link uh, click on them they will take you through to those products of river it is very very nice and now since we are continuing here i want you to listen to me very careful so when we are doing this i'm just going to imagine like we're still going to use the the imagination of the dreads that we have been doing so it means here even if we try to make a little bit like the box to be the, the lines our lines the boxes to be a little bit uh be big uh it, it 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 is also not bad it's not bad as long as it's not that very big and uh, you should always remember the thing that i told you that the more the spacing the more the extension like if you make sure that now your brain your your your, your spacing are like this if we try to remember how we've been doing the dreadlocks we don't space like this they're always like uh, in this box they they come uh, uh, you get like two of them so now it means even my extension that i'm going to use is going to are uh, going to be doubled like that you go, i'm going to double them to get uh this so it means if you have been using the other extension uh doing the 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 other the last red dreadlocks that we have been doing because for them they're smaller uh, the, the shape the the spacing are some are smaller so what we do uh, since like these ones are how somehow bigger what we do the other uh extension that you have been using on the other one just uh, make them double them to get this one you know why i always want to teach you about the extension it is that this hair lasts longer this hair lasts longer so we always have to make sure that we give we feed 
that our lines like our boxes the the ones that we do we feed them the extension that is going to last for uh, for all that long when the hair is still uh, held, holding it that uh, that to hold it firm you understand because now why I'm, I'm trying to give you this example because you might you might do something that is very uh is uh, like these boxes are somehow now big but if you put small extension, obviously it's going to be spaced. So we try to add the extension that is um, equivalent to the boxes that we do. But if you do it bigger, still it's no good. Because now if it's big, that means uh, it's not going to be held for all that long. You understand? Because we all know that when we do our dreads, we need them to last for years, for a year, but as long as you do repair. So what you do, you just have to make sure uh, you add the extension that you know that is going to last for all that long. And now, the method that we have been using, uh, this one doesn't change. The method that we have been using, we still continue with the same method. With the same method, like those ones who have been following us on these other last uh, tutorials that I've been doing, and then people keep on asking how to unlock these dreadlocks. This time around, I'm just going to indicate this still in the link. You can go and check it out and see how to unlock them because. Yeah, that is the question that I always get. And most of you guys think that I always lie. These dreadlocks cannot be unlocked, but you can unlock them. Because for us, um, I decided to create something that can protect our hair, but then after it can also last longer. And because that's what we always want. You understand? Yes, <laughs> to value our money. So now, this is how it is. And no matter how long it is, you should always try to know also this one when your clients want something long please please when she tells you to overpack sometimes it is wrong you understand at least you don't over space of course but still you don't have to overpack because now when you overpack it means you have to hold a small hair and now it's holding a small hair yet you're going to put some extension that is very long and still yeah, this hair is going to last for all that long when this person is locking it trust me it is not going to be protective at all that's why i always advise that try to first communicate with a client because now if a client tells you i want something long please try to um when you're plating you plate as you trying to observe the hair that you the lines that you're doing like most in especially in front in front if someone because now that's when people keep on saying pack pack you do the packing so in front if the hair is over packed trust me it's not good if the hair is, op is over packed in front it's not good trust me because uh you'll find like in um on the sides since the hair on the sides is always weak and now you over pack it yet it is going to be uh it is going it is long you understand yet it is long then uh, it is not going to be uh, good for you so what we should always do let's try to uh, know our hair type and then we can always ask for all uh, all that uh, hair cells yes so that's why we always do these mistakes like we choose the hair that is going to break our hair most of the times and then even us who plates who plates uh, we find like we are doing what you're asking it we are doing it in a wrong way so that's why i would explain more about the dreadlocks but what i've liked about these ones the individual um yes the other ones were also not uh painful and so this one i'm just trying to uh change a style yes like because the, i've i've been hearing those people asking like i want you to do for me a dread like the one that doesn't look like dreadlocks <laughs> you understand like because we always know that dreadlocks are those ones that are locked so i want to do dreads but don't lock them so yes this is it and you can also 
try to see how we have done it and trust me it is very very nice so it's all about you to tell me if it's true or false are these dreadlocks or not but i believe that dreadlocks and i know that dreadlocks because what means the meaning of dreadlocks is when it you can always have your dreads and you lock them you, you they last long to all that uh, uh all those years they want and then the good thing about it you just have to unplay it and get back your hair that is always like that is the good thing that we always want to get back our own hair so this one we don't lock Yes, my name is Maurice, the Crowchet Master, and I always do it my way. I say that I do it my way. That's what I always want. I do it my way, and I make sure that I I do it right. Yes, <laughs> it's all about creativity, and uh, yes, this is uh, the product that you can always buy. Uh, it's what we use the whole kit now we can apply this uh we can apply this for our after we're done yes after when we're done we can apply can always apply the email the we call it email and then this spray is very very nice and smells nicely yes so for now i'm gonna sign out bye bye guys we love you so so much Thank you.